Hello everyone, I'm Tom Rowe, Product Evangelist for CenterStack, and welcome to another CenterStack tutorial. There are a lot of solutions for cloud-based file management on the internet, so I think you should be aware of just how good CenterStack is for migrating your users and files to the cloud. In this video, I will show you how easy it is to use CenterStack's web portal. I'll also demonstrate how your users can easily install the client software. I will show you the mapped Windows Cloud Drive, and finally, I'll demonstrate some reliability and security features. So let's get started. Typically, the CenterStack administrator will create a tenant, which is like a company or a division within your management console. This tenant will have one or more tenant administrator users assigned and other non-administrator users, which have access to shared team folders. These folders have the same permissions and security settings you are used to seeing in the Windows Active Directory. I'm logging in as a standard user. As you can see, the CenterStack web portal is like a typical web page. You can navigate your folders and files here, download and upload files, and depending on the size of your screen, you can see that the contents here size, scale, and are otherwise responsive to that window constraints. So this web portal will work with any device that can open a web page URL. The files can be viewed in different ways, the same as if you alter the view settings in Windows Explorer. Here is a tiled thumbnail view, and by clicking this icon you can also show your files in a list view, which provides some more information to the user. Your users will need to get access to CenterStack and especially its shared team folders from their own personal computers. To do this, they will need to log in to CenterStack using a browser and the credentials you have provided them. If they were imported from an Active Directory account, the user can access CenterStack's web portal using their Windows login credentials. Once logged into the web portal, the user clicks their account icon and the download link for our client solutions. This opens the various client options. The reason you want your users to download their client software from your CenterStack server is because the client is already connected to the server and all they need to do is log in to get access to their files. This makes setting up your users, whether it is one user or a thousand users, a very simple process. Now we are looking at a machine where we are logged in as a user and they can see the cloud drive in Windows Explorer, just like any other drive on their system. What makes this better than other similar products is that these files are visible to your user because they have Windows NTFS permissions that authorize them to view or edit these files. These permissions are maintained from your CenterStack server and should you alter permissions on your NTFS file server that is linked through Active Directory for a specific user, those changed AD permissions will be synchronized with the cloud drive on the user system. We have implemented some very useful reliability and security features that go beyond a typical shared drive on the internet. As a tenant administrator, you can now decide how to break up your large files into smaller chunks. If you have very large files being synced, we use chunk upload to manage these files so that only the changes are synced, which can save a lot of time and bandwidth. We are using HTTP, which is a very fast streaming protocol. We have a robust fail, retry, and auto-retry functionality to ensure your files are synced. We have also included secure endpoint encryption at rest and in-transit encryption with HTTPS. If you are dealing with confidential files, you know how critical this feature is to keep you in compliance with various oversight agencies. So that covers some very important features of CenterStack. With easy web portal navigation and accessibility from any device type, easy client integration, eliminating the need for complex virtual private network management, and reliability and security features integrated through NTFS Active Directory permissions, you could see how good CenterStack is at migrating your users and data to the cloud. I hope you've enjoyed this overview of very useful CenterStack features. This is Tom, and I'll see you in the next video.